So, this weekend I went to the southern edge of the county to uh, go to the commons at Federal Way for the Twin Oaks Comics and Cards show. Uh, it's one weekend every month for eight months. And obviously I had to uh, not take the train the whole way. But I couldn't help but admire just how much progress they've made towards filling out that up-and-coming station between the Federal Way Transit Center and the Federal Way Park and Ride. Within one or two years, you'll be able to uh, go from the Washington State Trade and Convention Center to the SeaTac Airport. Uh, hotels are on there that still house classic hotel cons. And then down to the, uh, well, the mall for shows like this. Also has a cinema in there. Uh, beyond that, it's going to be downtown Tacoma not too long after. And, uh, there's a convention center there. But that is definitely getting ahead of ourselves. This was just an outing for them all. While ducking around to see them building the new Dick's Drive-In. Speaking of fun things to ingest, they were this month housing the show in front of the food court. I was used to the other entrance, so got a little turned around. Uh, Last time I'd been there, there were so many comics of your, or at least back when I was in high school. I don't like admitting how old I've gotten. Uh, uh, this time, this one stack and two halves was it. Uh, but lots of cards, though. So many cards, I was reminded of the... The MacGyver episode, where instead of politics of the Cold War, it was politics of the inner city, and it's the earliest example I know of of popular culture recognizing that these old collectibles were getting collector's value. I'm not sure what the future of the comics resale market is, but baseball cards... Basketball cards, definitely still going strong. Uh, there were some video games. A nice table of Funko Pops. But... The stuff that really had my interest previously wasn't there this time. I did get to check out some shops I didn't recognize. Uh, one of them had wall scrolls featuring anime characters and many other designs. I was reminded between cards and Pokemon cards uh, and more cards of similar types. And coming for back issue of comics, I used to come to this particular mall a lot more regularly, back when there was still a Mervyn's. Uh, they would have tournaments for Yu-Gi-Oh! every Saturday, and uh, they had back issues in the back, they had uh, Dragon Ball poster of Vegeta waiting for 
Gohan and Krillin to take up the Dragon Balls. They had a Sailor Moon poster with Usagi in a full actual sailor outfit instead of either of her Sailor Fukus. Uh, I described that memory to a handful of people, but it was ultimately nothing too significant. Before I went, though, uh, at least went home, I went out back and found there was a farmer's market as part of one of the stores that was selling used goods of various other types, including some costumes. Cosplayers might want to check that out. Uh... But the farmer's market uh, is also going on certain months of the year. Uh, but it looks like it's going to be every Saturday instead of just one Saturday. Um, I'm going to have to remember that next time I check this out. Anywho, uh, I hope I've piqued your interest. Um... If you went there, tell me how you liked it. I hope you enjoyed yourself. And next time, I hope I remember to ask ahead to see who's interested in what kind of Funko Pop. But that's for next time. Catch you again.